there, hope you are well. Gender identity is a deeply personal aspect of human experience, encompassing an individual's internal sense of their gender, which may or may not align with the sex assigned to them at birth. The distinction between trans men, individuals assigned female at birth who identify as male, and trans women, individuals assigned male at birth who identify as female, is critical in understanding the broader discourse on gender. Science, sociology and psychology all support the understanding that trans men are men and trans women are women, providing robust evidence for their identities. The understanding of gender identity has evolved significantly through research in diverse fields. Biological factors, such as genetics and hormones, play a role in shaping an individual's gender identity. Studies indicate that brain structures and neuroanatomy may differ between sexes and align more closely with individuals' gender identities than their assigned sex at birth. For instance, Research has shown that certain areas of the brain in trans women exhibit characteristics more consistent with cisgender women rather than cisgender men, suggesting a biological underpinning to their gender identity. Additionally, the interplay of hormones during critical periods of development is crucial. For trans men, masculinizing hormone therapies can lead to the development of secondary sexual characteristics aligning with their gender identity, further reinforcing their identity as men. For trans women, estrogen therapy helps them develop feminine features that resonate with their self-identification. The psychological understanding of gender identity has also made significant progress. The American Psychological Association, or APA, recognizes that being transgender is not a mental disorder, but an aspect of human diversity. Aligning with their gender identity has shown to greatly enhance the mental well-being of trans individuals. Research indicates that when trans people are supported in their identity, they experience lower rates of mental health issues, including anxiety and depression. The World Professional Association for Transgender Health, or WPATH, provides extensive guidelines affirming that gender identity is an important aspect of individual psychology and should be respected. They advocate for recognizing trans individuals as their identified gender, which is critical for access to necessary healthcare and mental health support. Socioculturally, the recognition of trans men as men and trans women as women reflects a broader understanding of gender as a spectrum rather than a binary construct. This perspective is supported by various cultural practices and historical contexts wherein diverse gender identities have existed across societies worldwide. Many indigenous cultures, for example, recognize two spirit individuals who embody both masculine and feminine traits, further illustrating the fluidity of gender. Legal recognitions and rights in numerous countries reflect a growing understanding of gender identity. Legislation that allows individuals to change their gender markers on identification documents reinforces the societal acknowledgement that trans identities are valid and deserving of respect and equality. In conclusion, the assertion that trans men are men and trans women are women is substantiated by scientific, psychological and socio-cultural evidence. Recognizing and affirming the identities of trans individuals is not only a matter of personal dignity, but is also supported by a body of research that underscores the legitimacy of their experiences. As society continues to evolve in its understanding of gender, it is essential to embrace these truths to promote inclusivity, equality and mental well-being for all individuals, regardless of gender identity. 
Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Take care and be well.